Hey baby, our signs, it is shadow of judgment. Your last ones, and then I can nap. I'm so fucking excited. I'm so tired. Oh, I'm so tired. So very, very tired. It was a long, strenuous evening. I need to. I had like a, I don't know. I was given a lesson last night. Which is listen to people when they tell you about certain folk. Regardless. Anyway, air signs. This is for you. So this is for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. This resonates with you a good deal. If not, do not worry about it. And please do not go in on me. Don't drag me. I'm too tired for that. I need naps. Anyway. This is for June 5th, which is today, to June... No, 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 no. 12th. Ah. King of Pentacles. Gemini, you're up first. Someone feels, like, bamboozled by some dude. Or does someone feel like there was a debt that needed to be paid? Or this dude expected something from somebody. Definitely moocher. Definitely not a provider. Definitely somebody who brags about his accomplishments but really doesn't do much. And over here we have the Page of Pentacles. <laughs> okay, look it. <laughs> I'm sorry, but this is like so back, like as above, so below. There was another. Um, I almost want to think it was Taurus. I think it was Taurus who I read for who had almost this exact same thing. A person looks one way, and then it's like another. Or it could even be this way, really. He thinks he's like, like uh, I don't know, it's just kind of like, you know, this person, well, exactly, they give so much because they don't have so much, they mooch it, and they like shit, and they will pretend shit, and they will withhold their love, if, if only to get that shit. Creepy, a weird person, indeed, very different. Um, could be water sign involved, definitely earth. Someone could be stingy and not offering anything, and this other person's like, I don't know how to offer shit, but here you go. You know? <laughs> like, I, I made it myself. I use, like, deer teeth and antlers, and I managed to bend everything. And I put little, like, um, pieces of shell from the ocean in there so it would have a little sparkle on it. It's made with love. And then, like, the King of Pentacles over here is like, you know what? I just bought this Rolex. I'm not giving it up. This person decided to walk away. Whoever this, uh, moocher is, right? They went to go to do better things because they were not offering their cup up. Whoever the hell they were. Um, this person wants to offer a pentacle up. Things seem to have gone down. Maybe there's a lack of closure somewhere. Someone's not offering their cup. Maybe this water sign right here isn't offering their cup to this person because it's like... Someone played some games and then they realized, you know games backfired. Okay, this page of pentacle is somebody who came from a broken home or like some shit. Or they're dealing with somebody who caused chaos in their home. Caused them to feel a certain way. Ugh. I could have walked away. It could be Capricorn in this. But I feel like they're walking into um, a very bad time with somebody else. Someone who's really not going to appreciate them as much as they think they will. Uh, but it's like just the beginning. Like this person over here, it, it, like this person doesn't care, and this person's like, I'm gonna learn to care. Uh, even though all these pentacles didn't work out well, I'm gonna try again. Might fail, but you know, they're willing to try again. Because they walked away from this person who was playing games. Yeah. Oh, look at that! They turned out fabulously fine. They're fine. They're fine. They didn't get the ten pentacles they wanted, but, they, but they're fine. They totally re-upped. Okay. That's good. I'm happy. <laughs> that makes me happy for this person. Uh, this person's, like, trying to combat some shit, though. Damn, Gemini, what the hell's going on with you? It's like you're fighting. Something? These all fell, but I'll read them. Uh, something didn't happen, and I think it left you really fucking confused. I'm not sure. And... 
it's like there's a queen of wands here, Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries, who's like, she's trying to turn her head away from all of this like shit that's in her brain because it's just like this isn't doing me any good. It's actually starting to piss me off just a little bit. Guards, bring me the axe. You know, like they're just losing her shit because like this shit's keeping her up at night. Someone wants to charge ahead. They might be coming off very selfishly with it. It could be a cancer. And someone could be judging them harshly because of this. Um, this could also be two people with fucking ego problems. Um, and this person is just running away from it all. It's just like, you know what? I Like, you, like, like you bother me too much. I'm going to be selfish and run away. Sometimes selfishness is not a bad thing. Especially if someone isn't being fair and taking action where it doesn't belong. Also, that fire sign probably got pissed, so, you know, that could have happened. They just lost patience with this king of cups. Yeah, someone is not a happy camper. Someone's feeling bitter and has their back turned to everything. And this person's, like, holding a grudge. Wow, okay. <laughs> so, definitely... Hmm. Wow. Like, someone's really, like, in their feelings about shit, and the other person is just like, I am not even dealing with your shit. Like, walked away because, you know, I don't know. It's like, this one's too upset with how things went to understand that they're becoming a bit bitter about it. And this person is just like, you know, like, I'm gonna be... I might be not get my Ten of Pentacles, but I'll at least have nine, and then I'll be better than you out of spite, brat, you know? <laughs> like, this is what it kind of feels like between... It's almost like a contest. Like, one's trying not to care as much as the other, and it's just really combative. All because, like, this person on this road didn't offer their cup and played games. Decided to be combative, I think. Put this person in their feelings, and then put themselves in their feelings a little bit, Gemini. Um... Or you could have done that to yourself and now you're pissed at yourself or something too. I don't know. I feel like this person decided to walk away because they thought it was toxic, but it's like, well, it was. Um, you know, you walked away instead of like handing this dude what he was asking for. I feel like that was the toxicity because it was like competitiveness and like mean spirited possibly words or thoughts or intentions and manipulations and shit. All because someone didn't want to be, like, lovey and shit. I don't know, Gemini. But, that's your shadow. Libra, what's going on with your shadow? Oh, that was a whistle of judgment. <laughs> that was definitely a whistle from the teeth. What's going on with your shadow, Libra? What are you up to, Libra? Libra, Libra. We got so far. Someone might be running away, talking shit like they do, because they ain't happy. They're just going back to things because they aren't happy where they are at right now. Feels like their options aren't very good for them at all. They think they can get away with shit. <laughs> what the hell? Wow. Who is this? Huh. You're looking for a balance. This could definitely be you when it comes to this whole unhappiness right here. They might be. They might think that they can't give you the happiness, or there's just no way to get them back to you. Because it's like they're going back to the past, but they're trying to sneak away as well, or like get away with like these options that didn't work out. Uh, yeah, it just led to betrayals. It's like they're afraid to betray themselves. Usually I've said if it's reversed, but I don't, I don't, I don't feel like, you know. Yeah, they, it, it, yeah they're not going anywhere. <laughs> they're not going any damn where. Um, I feel like you want to communicate a little bit, Libra, on this side. I feel like you're not having, you want to communicate something. You know, like, if something didn't work out when it came to, like, some sort of closure or whatever. Um... Someone wants to move to calmer waters and be happy. Possibly a Leo in this mix as well. Um, 
Because some water sign was just too stuck up their own ass to notice that the tower was burning. Just like, I don't know what's going on here. But that's a duh. You know, it's just kind of like, dude, the tower has come down. The illusion is over. Um, almost like ignoring one's feelings. Hmm. Yeah, oh, okay, okay. Um, eh. no options are available because there was a betrayal, and that led to, like, the one cup they really wanted to be poured right in their lap because it was coffee. It had burned a lot. They got burned. Huh. Oh, I can do bad all by myself. Okay. <laughs> I don't know. Or this person thinks that they're a trophy wife. One of the two. Over here, there's anxiety and shit. Hmm. I feel like almost this person says that they want to go. And they're trying to go. But they never leave. Could be cancer in this, right? But I feel like they just never fucking leave. This person over here might be you, Libra. You're trying to get balance and communicate, but it's like... This betrayal, whatever options it led to that led to this cup being knocked over, it's like it's bothering you. You're in your state of mind. This person over here is just like living in la-la land, being like, I put an apple on a bird's head. And you're over here like... Crying, weaving, staying up at night. And this person acts like they're just fine. Or is this you doing all of this at once to yourself? Like you talk about leaving and then you don't. But it's like, are you really doing that? Or are you just being sneaky sneaks? Or are you kind of lying? Making it seem like something that's not? I don't know. This could be you or someone else, Libra. Hmm. Something's definitely keeping you up at night, though. That's your shadow judgment, though, so take it as is. Or take some more. Whichever one, of course. Aquarius! It's your reading now. Yay! Ugh, so tired. After this, I shall nap. And then get some personal done that I still got left over. Only got a few. So I might be able to open up before my date. I'm probably gonna like add some additional stuff in the description box below. Okay, Aquarius. I'll let you guys know, I promise. Someone's going out of some really bad vibrations, but there's some things that they still haven't recovered from yet. They're trying to work on it though. They might be like chilling, hanging out with people at work at the water pool or like, I swear to God, the witch burned and she screamed and all of a sudden like you know she starts singing Yankee Doodle Dandy and everyone just starts laughing it's great um Greg was there you know watercolor stuff in the middle ages you know maybe a leech or two on um Hector kind of creeps somebody out yeah someone walked away from a bad situation could have been with a Capricorn very uh what people call toxic relationship they walked away from that despite the love and they went to work on something else but there's still things they haven't recovered from yet physically mentally yeah and that's because something hasn't changed with them i feel like, like in a way aquarius i feel like you're impatient with your own transformation like you're working on it you are working on it Like you're like, damn it, I need to get this done. Could be with a king of pentacles in here. Capricorn towards Virgo, right? Provider kind of person. Something's not moving over here. Yeah, you feel like you're stalled or stuck or something. Like I thought I like it's almost like I thought I left you. Why am I still here? Like, you know, 
Uh, like you, like you want everything. Like it feels like you're not transforming to be independent and on your own a little bit. You know. Um, this guy is not taking a leap of faith, so I feel like that's why you want to be independent because he's not really doing anything. And it's annoying. Secrets. Ooh. Betrayals and bad options. Aquarius. Mm. I don't know. It's like you're stuck in this mode. Or you want to leave this shit, but it feels like you're not going anywhere. You you might want to work on this with this King of Pentacles, or vice versa, or whoever it is. It doesn't even need to be the sign. Uh, but they're not taking a leap of faith towards you while you're in their Nine of Pentacles. Uh, and if they did, it'd probably be betrayal because there's these options are all shitty and there's still secrets that are unknown. Could be Pisces or a Cancer, right? Mm. I feel like you want to recover and it just it just feels like nothing's happening for you and it's frustrating you. Like you're literally just like, I thought I left you. Why am I still here in this position? What is it, universe? I don't know. Speak to me. I think your emotions are also causing you to feel like a little bit more hurt than what you want to. It's like, Jesus Christ, like I, I just want to stop being this emotional. And you can't because there are dogs barking in the background. It's getting all up in your nerves. Right? Right. Aquarius, that was your shadow judgment for this week. Thank you for watching my video. I really appreciate it. If you want to like, share, subscribe, go ahead and do that if you want to. No pressure, of course. I hope you guys have a good day, and I will see you later. Love you. Bye-bye.